All right, we are gonna get started with setting up Touch Chat. Um, so the first thing you're gonna see when you open up Touch Chat is a lot of different vocabularies. Um, word power is the recommended vocabulary. There's lots and lots of different things that you can look through. Um, but word power has a lot of different um, features and word prediction. Um, so word power 60 is really where most professionals say you should start um, looking through. So we're gonna look at this really quick so you can get an idea of what it looks at. Word power 60, the basic version, because it has um, lots of literacy things built into it. So let's check this one out. We're gonna click on this one. And so in the home page, you see there's a good mix of core words and different folders that you can go to, um, actions, adjectives, groups. So this is what this looks like. Um, if you're worried that the buttons maybe are a little too small, my recommendation would be to screenshot this and print it out um, and then you know see what your child um, feels comfortable pointing to. Um, you can also, we're gonna go back to here to word power. Some people use 42 if they're concerned, you know, that their child will not be able to press those buttons. So you could also try out this one. The basic one is also the recommended one for this. Um, so you can see there's less words here, still lots of folders and stuff. Um, but maybe, you know, if you're concerned that there's too many buttons on the 60, um, you can try out 42. Um, a really, another really good one, if you think more words the better, is the word power um, 108. The word power 80 is, is, is kind of strange. You can look at it yourself, but it has a keyboard on the homepage. So unless you're child is literate and typing already, I wouldn't recommend 80. So 108, um, this one SS without the keyboard. As you can see, there's a lot of core words here um, and lots of different things for grammar. So this is also a really good one. So between the word power 60 basic, um, 42 and the 108, you know, maybe get a feel for what you think your child would be interested in. Um, and you can try all three of them with them um, and even ask them what you think, what they think would be the best, um, what they feel the most comfortable with. So once you decide, and I know that's a pretty big decision, I'm just gonna go to 60, basic SS. Um, this is what it looks like again. So you're gonna go to menu. We're going to do copy of vocabulary and we're gonna go down to word power, 60 basic SS. And now we will name it um, your child's name. So I'm gonna put mine, mine is Caleb. And I'm gonna say 60 new, um, Okay, save, and then you're gonna see it's gonna show up here. And so that is how you create, select your vocabulary and create a new one.